students are working on the survey and excavation of a small shipwreck that dates to the early 19th century. Something that they don't just read about in a textbook or a report years later, they're actually here doing it on the ground. They'll be mapping, recording, they'll be drawing, so manually from offsets as well as trilateration. Um, they learn skills like photogrammetry, um, but they'll also be setting out grids and excavating on the side, dredging. This is actually how to do all of these skills from start to finish. Um, so it's been really beneficial as a student of archaeology and also just meeting people, networking with all of these other professionals who later down the line you might go back to and do a master's or PhD with or even get a job. There's very few field schools like this that are run around the world and it's, it's very rare to find one um, that, that does underwater archaeology and I think that this has been done very well. The collaboration between Heritage Victoria and Flinders University is really good for the students. It allows them to practice their field-based skills. And then the data that they collect is something practical which Heritage Victoria could then use and then store within uh, a data set that is otherwise absent in the archaeological record. We're trying to get them to start to become maritime archaeologists. So the, their diving improves, their project planning improves, their understanding of the site improves and that two week build up is important to get that done.